Tonight, this is a high-level wrestler of the highest order. No questioning the cardio. He's got a big fight in front of him here tonight. Every time he steps foot into the octagon, he does one thing, and that's embrace the grind. He gets right in your face, he pushes forward, he gets to the clinch, loves the single leg takedown. If you can grab your leg, it's like getting caught in a vice grip, getting grabbed by a crocodile. He is going to finish it. He starts to run his feet immediately. When he can get you moving, he is always looking to advance from position one to position two to eventually finishing that great single leg that he possesses. And when he closes the distance, best of luck trying to buck this guy off of you. He does pummel drills in his sleep. Big fight for him. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make him yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this featherweight fight. So these fighters are just a year apart with similar height and reach. All right, to get us started now, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Brussels, Belgium, Iceman. And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, Fighting at Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, just make it a in a number of ways. Let's see how he manages this fight against a guy that can do just about everything inside the octagon. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Oh, nice jab. Good punch. Oh, huge block! All right, 
He'll engage in a single collar tie. with the kick there, no pat on that foot. No shin guard, he's taking all of that kick every time he throws. Also single collar tie there. Oh, big right hand, yes. Nice straight punch. Punch coming, it's blocked. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Just over three minutes to go. What a body kick. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. There's no tell on that leg kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Just out of range with the straight left hook. The right hook to the body. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Beautiful leg kick throw. Trying to kick the leg out. Left hook landed on the button. Single collar tie. Big head kick. Shot to the body, turned back by Lee. Another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Oh, he got that knee to connect to the body, and if you're the defensive fighter here, you gotta make sure you don't eat too many more of those. You cannot eat too many. You gotta get the elbows inside. Because otherwise, it's gonna land one that's gonna shut everything down. Let's get going. Lee's kick to the body, that one blocked. You gotta get the down. And he caught the kick, we'll see what he can do with it. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to me. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Oh, he got everything behind that kick. Seconds left. All oh, collar tie. Starting to do some. Oh! He's getting lit up right now, John. Trying to stay in this fight. Blocks that strike. So a strong five minutes down. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC. And uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding. And look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. Eyes starting to take a beating. Looks like he might be getting close. You have to be careful now. Be cautious. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. 
connects with a right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Lee's kick, that one blocked. <laughs> Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Oh. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Single collar tie now. Trying to establish that jab once again. Strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick. He somehow is managing to land it with so much force. Well, he has got to be thrilled with this effort here tonight. There was a lot of pressure on him coming in. He has doled out a lot of damage, landed a lot of strikes, near flawless execution. Sometimes the hardest thing to do is what's expected. When you're expected to win, sometimes it's hard to live up to that expectation. He lived up to that expectation, and he exceeded it with such a great performance. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he gonna do to follow up? Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. Very accurate, a lot of activity in the hands. Look phenomenal tonight. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step to get him to slow down and fight at your pace. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Hands high, hands high. <laughs> Great punch landed with so much power. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Ooh, looking to set up the head kick, but he misses. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, well done to block that powerful kick to the body. Look at the turnover in that kick. Significant welt to the left side. Oh, beautiful! Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Just missed on that spinning attack. Ooh, what a punch. Head kick. And he landed the right hand there. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go we'll get him. Oh, straight right. Oh, vicious kick to the outside of that lead leg. You got to start checking these, these man. You got to check these kicks, or you're going to be limping around the octagon very short. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Ooh, what a head kick. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead, and I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. Right. Look at that. You got the better of that round. You better 
you a little bit. If you hung there tough, you showed you had heart to be a champion. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their turn. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight idea. Punches blocked. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Holding on to him here, not really doing too much, perhaps just looking to recover. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Very nice leg kick there by Luke. Oh, good kicks. Wow! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Now a kick to the body. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Well, that'll quiet the storm. Shot blocked by Lee. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. There's no kill on that leg kick. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick there, DC. Beautiful setup to get his leg up there quickly before his opponent could react. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh, a huge block there. This is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Beautiful punch. And they separate. Great upper body movement defensively. Slips another strike there and... Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Nice kick. Right hand upstairs. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Look at how he turned his hip into that leg kick. Ooh, big shot lands. Oh, goes to the roundhouse kick now and lands. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What a devastating technique, the roundhouse kick. Lee gets touched by that kick there. How about that chin? I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Big call from Punch Lance. Now he gets back to range. Right hand on the counter. Oh, nice. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Man, the body work continues to be a factor here. Look at the size of that bruise on his body. Nice one, two there. All right, single collar tie now. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. What a tricky head kick. Big punch lands through the middle. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault, 
and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. Let's go back out there and look to finish him. All right, let's get you a replay from that previous round. It was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that, that nearly closed the show for good. It almost closed the show, but nothing's more discouraging than when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door. He has to go back to work now knowing that he's got about as tough a guy as, if, as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Ooh, blocks the shot. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Oh, and he got tagged by that combination. His coach said on Thursday to us, it has to be punches and bunches. It has to be volume. And his student has certainly followed up on that imperative. So much volume, but the accuracy, the accuracy of this fighter is truly unbelievable. Just out of the range with that right hand. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. Never looked this good. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. We'll see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh, beating his leg up. He does everything so well. And he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Kick to the body by Lee. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Real nice body. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Not a ton behind it, but it landed. Big leg kick lands. He blocks the punch. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Well, he landed. Oh, he's hurt. He's got him right here. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs. Throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. minute. 
Well, working pretty effectively from the top here. Nice ground and pound by Lee. 45 seconds remain in the round. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. 20 seconds now remain in the round. We'll show you some of the action here, and you gotta think the knockdown is gonna be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin, but he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. Ready, fight. Ready. Fifth and final round. Look at him drive his shin up to the whole spot with that body. Nice punch lands. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, straight to the body by Lee. Good defense to block the strike coming back. Right at the elbow. Right at the oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Back and forth we go. Oh, he was hurt. So holding on to him here, not doing a ton, perhaps just looking to recover. Big kick land. Spinning back fist. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Big left hook coming, it's blocked. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, and he gets tagged. Nice combination there, and might not be a bad idea for the opposition to just tweak that head off yeah. the center line. He was landing one before. Now he's throwing everything in combination, and they're all landing. Missed with that right hand. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. So fire a little bit stuck. No! All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent, you got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Push up, Sam. Oh, he is up, but man, is he hurt. A finish could come here at any time. All right, under two minutes now to decide this one. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Oh, my goodness! What a fight! Pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming. 
and before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called to stop for this contest at three minutes, four seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Oh, well, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what? I mean, I'm heading over there right now, John. <laughs> I'm asking the producers, how soon can I get up? Because it's going to be a party over there. Not only because of the knockout, but that extra bonus check he's going to be carrying to the club tonight.